Well, by now you've done some work in New York. You've done some sessions and some recordings, mm -hmm. a right. podcast in New York, and, including one that Adam and Sona and I want to talk to you about. Okay. This hasn't happened at the time of this recording, but we all feel a little, what would the word be? Sad? Jealous. Jealous. Yeah. I don't know what you're talking about. I honestly don't. The three of us have a massive crush on Matthew Reese. Mm -hmm. And we just want you to send him our love. Yeah, I don't know if I can do that. <sighs> oh, come on. Yeah. That's... Why? Well, first of all, my, my time is very valuable. And Matthew Reese is, I mean, God, it's such a brilliant actor and raconteur. I just love that he's coming on the podcast, sort of waste time saying, hey, before you get going, there are these people. <laughs> you don't have to do it before you get It can going. be after. Yeah. It can totally yeah. be after. The first time he was on, it was over Zoom. And I think we all sort of fell head over heels. Yeah. And uh, none of us yeah. are going to be able to meet him in person this yeah. time. Yeah. Here's how it's going to go. <laughs> My plan is that if Matthew Reese ends up being on this podcast a total of six times. Yeah. None of you will ever meet him. Come on. Do you purposely plan really cool? I mean, we've had yes, a do. lot of really cool guests, yeah. but well, sometimes you are... really get someone you know we're going to love and then you do it somewhere else. And we can't be there. You did this with Oliphant the second time you, you had did. him on in yeah. New York. Yeah, he was on New York because Oliphant and I, it's a it's a special time when we're together. I was cool with the way that one worked out. Yeah, because you were there. You, you were there gun. too. I got to spend a lot of time with him. Oh, yeah. congrats. Another you got to do a whole segment with him. <laughs> huge, so great. Another no, huge Now, wait a minute. To be fair, when I interviewed Tommy Lasorda, you guys were here. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, so you got him. You weren't even here for that. No, I, <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, whenever there's an older baseball manager, I always make sure that you guys get to meet. I just think him. we're a team yeah. and sometimes you go rogue and I get it. It's your podcast and stuff, but still. No, no, like, no, I don't think... be silly. Oh. It's our podcast. I just happen to be the star. <laughs> Does that, did that come out right? No, it's, um, I, I don't know. Did it? I guess. I just want to meet Matthew Reese. So do I. And yeah, you're getting in the way. You're, you're, you're cock blocking all of yeah. us. <laughs> you're pod blocking us. <laughs> I'll tell you what I'll do. If you guys can write me a little message or something to him. We could record a little message for him right now. I prefer you <laughs> write a message and then just trust that I'll give it to him. <laughs> Ugh. What do you mean? You won't though. You'll lose it. What would you say to Matthew Reese that is so important? Dear Matthew. Oh, I didn't yeah. realize this was yes. a. <laughs> Let's go around the this table. A school, a school essay, a fifth yeah. grade essay. Yeah. Hi, my name is Sonam Obsessian. You don't know me, but I watched you in The Americans and I love you. What's it like to be married to Carrie Russell? Yeah. I just heard her name. I, come on, hold on. That's right. Wow. What's this it like great. to be married to Carrie Russell? I love her curls. You're a lucky guy. She's a lucky girl. I hope we're friends one day. Love, Sonam Obsession. Hey, whether you're stuck in traffic okay. or streaming your favorite podcasts, that's where I come in, it's important to have a network you can trust wherever you are. Say it with me, T-Mobile. T-Mobile. Yeah, you didn't really have to say it with me. Oh. But it is your network. You know, I'm excited about T-Mobile. Yeah. You're killing it. And uh, you know who's really excited? is our good friend Blay, yes. who's been using this service. Blay, tell us about it. Yeah, I have been a T-Mobile subscriber for a really long time. It, they're awesome. Mm -hmm. I download videos all the time. Yeah, you Light, do. You, you download a lot of videos. <laughs> yeah. I do. Now, you've never read a book. <laughs> no, no, books are overrated. But, yeah. Uh, yeah. And I listen to this podcast on a hike. Fantastic. Up in the mountains. You listen to our podcast? I will contract You I work here. Yeah, I have, to, I have to. I have to listen to it. But it's great. And, and, and honestly, like the coverage is, is insane. Uh, and yeah, I, I love the service. I love the phone. It's fantastic. Experience for yourself how T-Mobile is America's largest and fastest 5G network. You can't top them. I like all the Gs. You bet you do. <laughs> Find out more at tmobile.com slash CY. That's S-E-E-W-H-Y. Fastest based on median overall combined 5G speeds according to analysis by Ookla of speed test intelligence data for Q4 2022. Good. Wow. That's incredible. <laughs> yeah. I said exactly what they wanted me to do. <laughs> you just See read it 5G details at tmobile.com. Okay. Um, if that was your intention, if that's what you were going to say to him, 
I'm really happy that you're not going to New York. <laughs> okay, wait. Adam can't say got... shit like that to Matthew Yes, I Reese. can. Yes, I can. Yeah. Compliment his wife, who I loved, who's a curly hair icon. Yeah, I can. Right. Oh, yeah. They both are. Yeah. Oh. Matthew I, Reese. I would, I would okay. start with Americans, but then I would, I would really lean into his last appearance on the podcast and how he just blew us away with his humor, which... You know, you don't always get to see because he's such a great actor and does a lot of serious roles, but he has such a good personality, so charming, mm -hmm. was actually really, I remember him being so nice to us. I think when we were getting him like all set up with yeah. his uh, Zoom, he was just, we. I think we all just kind of became best friends with him in that moment, but yeah. haven't yeah. spoken to him since. And so we love <laughs> to. Uh, I think this is all unprofessional and, and borderline creepy. Well, you haven't even heard mine yet. Oh, I'm sure this will right the boat. <laughs> Off you go, freaky. Hey, Matt. What's it like having the same name? <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? You're from Wales, and I'm from Whittier. Two W places. Uh, I really loved Perry Mason. I love you, love you a lot, too. If you want to just hang out, hit up my man, Conzi. He's got my deets. And miss you. Thank you. Miss Bye. You. <laughs> Um, who has control over what happens? Eduardo, you have these tapes now, do you not? Uh, I know where they are. Yeah. Tapes. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, digital <laughs> recordings. Uh, recordings. Okay. Okay. I don't know. How do you, what do you refer to them as now? Recordings. You have these wax cylinders. Yes. Um, make sure that they're in my possession. You got it. What okay. are you, you going to do with them? I'm going to hand deliver them to Matthew Reese. That's what I'm going to do. And you're going to trust that he I did it. He could just email it to like his rep. Yeah. He yeah. could just email him to his no. rep yeah. right now. Yeah. We no, could no, no. do it right after yeah. this podcast. Nope, that's not the way I like to do it. I like to give the personal touch. I'm going to write a little handwritten note with it. And then you guys are just going to trust that I gave these to Matthew Reese. Do you think you purposely keep us away because you're embarrassed of us a little bit? <laughs> Uh, I'm going to say that's 80% true. Oh. What's the other 20% that I get more focus on me? Oh. So it's embarrassment, uh, that you guys will screw it up. And then there's 20% of it is me just wanting more time with Matthew Reese. Oh, get it. The, one idea I had was just yeah. hear me out. We could talk to Paula about rescheduling. <gasps> Maybe oh. for when we can all be there with oh. Matthew Reese. Oh, that's, let me just check my schedule and see if that works. Oh. Those are no, it not, can't. That's not your schedule. No, 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 no. I'm entering Thanks. the priesthood shortly after we... Sh <sighs> so, um, oh, and then I'm uh, in the circus. Yeah, it doesn't work out. Okay. Oh, and then I'm working for that Zeppelin company. Uh, for those reasons, um, that was fair. just relax. Why don't you do this? Just trust that I form a, a strong enough connection with Matthew Reese that he wants to come back. And on the third go round, you guys will get to be behind glass when I interview him. <laughs> oh, you could fly us out too, just for that day. No, no. This uh, podcast is hemorrhaging money mm, uh, because yeah. of a certain Matt Gorley's spending habits. Yeah. When he buys stuff now, kooky stuff at the Rose Bowl swap meet, he charges it to the <laughs> podcast. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. He bought a 1938 Zamboni. Yeah. Oh. Just, yeah, it was a hipster thing. I and now have 36 through 48 <laughs> all year Zambonis. Yeah. <laughs> True story. My wife uh, is uh, her step grandma was a Zamboni. She was heir to the Zamboni f fortune. So just. Is that. Is that true? true? That's true. Is Wait she, a minute. Is, is that really true? Zamboni? true? I just yeah. threw out Zamboni from my random, the random part of my brain. Yeah. What? That's a real, Amanda's that's a family name? Grandma? It's her step grandma's maiden name and she was a wealthy heiress of the Zamboni family. I don't know what else to cool. say. Matthew, you listen? Is that pretty cool? Well, more proof that you should get a lot of talking time with Matthew Reese. <laughs> <laughs> Loved you. Love Perry Mason. Yeah, that's great. Guys, just let me handle let me handle the heavy hitters. All right. You guys are all fun. When we book someone on the podcast who was third lead in a movie that didn't really go, I, I'm very comfortable with you being here. But when it's these heavy hitters, uh, I think I need to uh, handle it myself. You understand? I, I feel like they notice our absence, though. Yeah. I feel like he, he I feel like. The way you notice the absence of pain. Yes. I feel like he's going to be like, hey, where are Matt and Sona mm -hmm. and Adam? Yeah. And then I'm going to mm -hmm. be like, yeah. mm -hmm. you know, and then you have to like have that awkward conversation. What if he listens to this podcast? He's a fan. What if he listens to this podcast? Could be. A lot Come of guests on. listen to the podcast. Yeah. Yeah. Please. Some, yeah. some do. Uh, yes, some do. Tommy a Lissota. lot of people do. This is a Tommy very, Lissota, yeah. very uh, successful podcast. Uh, but no, 
Matthew Reese, I assure you, he's a classically trained Welsh actor. He's a man. He's a good looking guy. Yeah. Charming. Yeah, charming. He just, is. Just so charming. Yeah. I can't wait to see him. <sighs> Are Maybe you going to? You're going to what? What if you guys become friends? Yes. What's wrong with that? A uh, lot. A lot. A, if, if anyone out of the four of us is going to be friends with Matthew Reese, I don't think it should be you. Yeah. What are you, you talking don't appreciate about? It like we do. I just don't think that. I don't know. I don't think you can hang with him and Carrie. Mm -mm. I keep bringing what up. What are you going to do with Matthew Reese? You going to take him to the Altadena Seven Eleven <laughs> and buy him a Slim Jim? I'm sorry. <laughs> and don't even get me started on you. What? Oh, I'm sorry. This I happen to know he restores <laughs> old sailboats. So you think that's not up my alley? That kind of thing. He and I will get along. We'll be fast friends. We'll be you work on small toy sailboats. He works on real sailboats that a man can get into. Anything you do. Oh, that is not true. I am quite the seaman. Yeah. I have. I have been at sea many a time. I uh, have sailed off the coast of Boston, Rhode Island, uh, Cape Cod. I've uh, sailed off the rough seas of Block Island. <laughs> uh, my face is weathered by the salty spray and old Neptune's ire. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, none of you were ever meeting Matthew Reese. That's the end of this segment. We'll see. Okay. Never going to happen.